Good morning, junior school students, teachers, parents and carers. Welcome to our junior school virtual assembly. I would like to respectfully acknowledge the traditional owners on the land on which this event is taking place. I pay my respects to elders past, present and emerging. Please stand silently for our national anthem. I call its values after me. We show diligence. We show diligence. We show integrity. We show integrity. We show courage. We show courage. And we show empathy. We show empathy. Please repeat our call its rules after me. We are respectful. We are respectful. We are responsible. We are responsible. And we are safe. And we are safe. Please be seated. I would like to invite Chappie Hannah to share an important message with us. Hi everyone, it's Chappie Hannah here. Next Wednesday, the 24th of June, we're having a crazy sock and shoe day. Feel free to wear the craziest socks you have and some clothes in shoes. Uh, bring a gold coin donation and that will support my role here as chaplain for four days a week. Thank you, bye. I would like to invite Miss Gwen Ben to share some important messages with you. Good morning, everyone. I'm so glad to say that we have made it to week nine. How great is that? And the best thing about week nine is that next week is week 10. You know that you have two weeks holiday at the end of week 10. I really hope you get a time to enjoy them with your family or your friends and just sit back and relax because we have had a very, very mixed up but interesting term. I would like to remind you that over the next few days, I would like you to concentrate on not running on the concrete. When I've been walking around the school during breaks and also between classes, I've noticed that some people are running on the concrete. We have had quite a number of students had to come down to the office to get ice because they've hurt themselves when they've been running. So can you remember please, between now and when the holidays start, to really focus on not running on the concrete. I hope you have a wonderful week and a great week next week and look forward to those holidays that are fast approaching. Have a lovely day. Thank you. I would like to invite Mrs McCann to share our student recognition and reading certificates. Certificates will be given to your teachers to present to you. It gives me great pleasure to announce this week's Student of the Week. From Prep Green, Iro for writing an excellent retail of the Three Billy Goats Graph. To Hayden for writing an excellent retell of the Three Billy Goats Graph. From Prep Orange, Crystal, for your fabulous behaviour this week, we're so proud of you. Ariana, for always trying her best and being such a happy friend. From Prep Blue, Jar, for settling into a new school and making new friends. Amrit, for persistence with her learning. From Year One, Alan for fantastic work in maths problem solving. Jasmine for developing confidence with her daily writing. Dylan 
for constructing interesting sentences in our daily writing, and Katie for settling into the school routine and always trying hard. From year two, Ava for continuing to improve in all writing tasks. Keep up the great effort. Sebastian for showing persistence and confidence to improve his spelling. Jiho for consistently completing his homework to a high standard. And Lauren for her fairy tale character comparison. From year three, a leader for a well written narrative with an imaginative resolution. And Hugo, an exceptionally well written narrative using lots of descriptive language. From year four, Kale for working hard at staying at your desk during working time. And Dustin for working hard at staying focused during classwork. To Bailey for remaining focused during spelling groups. And for Samrit for fantastic work during spelling groups. In year five, Mitchell for putting an awesome amount of effort into his torch test and Simon for putting fantastic effort into all of his assessment pieces. To Kyan for giving everything a great effort. And Savita for your wonderful work ethic in all the tasks that you're given. To Leyden, your outstanding application to English assessment and much improved reading comprehension. And Xavier, your outstanding effort and results during your English and reading comprehension. From Year 6, Lucas, for smashing your three minute maths, great job. And Aisha for being focused and persistent in your torch test. Well done to each of those students. At Earnshaw, we really love our reading and we know that if you can read, you can do anything. This week, these students have reached 100 nights of reading. Congratulations to Cooper in 3B, Olivia from 2B, Tanisha from 2B, Haley from 3A, Eden from 3A, Anamari from 3A, and Levi from 3A. Congratulations, Kavia from 1B, and Kota from 6C. Well done to each of those students. Our earnings for week nine have been counted. This week's totals are Bradman on 217, Rafter on 279, and O'Neill on 323. Congratulations, O'Neill. You have earned the most points for your house this week. I'd like to invite our junior sports captains to draw our Ernie winners for this week. Winners will each receive a voucher for the talk shop. So the Bradman winner for this week's Ernie draw is... Ari from 2C. The O'Neill winner for this week is... Mason. And the Rafter winner for this week is... Mustafa. Thank, Thank you for viewing our Junior School Virtual Assembly. Have a wonderful day and a safe weekend.